Hello, family and friends of Seward United Methodist Church. It's Reverend Mary Kay for Midweek Devotion. Hope everyone is doing well this week. My granny Tati was a strong woman of faith, and she read the Bible through many times. She read various authors about scripture, but she always thought for herself. She taught my dad. She taught me and others to look for the golden thread that weaves all the way through scripture. I believe that golden thread is grace, God's grace, unmerited, unearned, steadfast, and reliable. About four years ago in 2018, I was thinking about that thread of grace running all the way through scripture. And I was thinking about how we like to shorten everything into sound bites. And I got to thinking, well, what would scripture be like if it were sound bite scripture? And this is what I wrote. So this is going to be a mad dash through the Bible for sound bite scripture. I wrote it in the fall of 2018. God created, Adam and Eve made it. Noah's Ark survived the flood, grace abounds. Abraham welcomed strangers, Hagar and Sarah birthed nations, Moses wandered, Miriam danced, Sinai established command and covenant, grace abounds. Joshua fit the battle of Jericho, Deborah judged with wisdom, Jael wielded a mean tent peg, Gideon demanded a fleece of proof, Ruth never abandoned Naomi. Grace abounds. The people demanded a king. King Saul was unseated by David who slayed giants. Abigail brokered peace. Solomon built the temple. Job challenged God. Jonah ran from God. Empires conquered Israel and Judah. People turned away from God. Prophets called them back to God. And every time, every time, God welcomed them. Grace abounds. Wisdom weaves through psalm and proverb, both teaching that God's steadfast love endures forever. Daniel faced down lions. Amos set a plumb line. Isaiah's dream still calls us. Micah knew what God requires. People longed for a Messiah. Grace abounds. Mary agreed to birth a savior. Joseph became her accomplice. Caesar taxed. Bethlehem welcomed Emmanuel in a manger. Grace abounds. Jesus calls disciples, healed the sick, fed the hungry challenged powers and principalities, welcomed children, transformed lives, broke bread, shared cup, covenanted anew, was falsely accused and crucified. Three days later, an empty tomb was all the women found. Grace abounds. Holy Spirit anointed, the church was birthed and grew, spreading from Jerusalem to Corinth, from Rome to Ephesus. Peter baptized, Paul wrote, Lydia led, Timothy preached, Dorcas served, letters got passed around and handed down, visions of hope sustained to the end. Grace abounds. So that's my version of Soundbite Scripture. Hope you all enjoyed it. Hope you have a good week. 
I will be heading out to visit my dad, God willing. The trip's been canceled twice this year, so hope I actually make it to Baton Rouge this time to see my father. And I know Pastor Jen will be here Sunday to bring a good message, and you'll want to be here to support her. And I'll see you when I get back. I'll see you September 4th. Take care. God bless.